Brandon! Brandon! What? Put some Janet Jackson on. I'm not putting Janet Jackson on, okay? Uh, oh, excuse me. For recon tonight. I found a group of girls to pose as real patrons. That's Jessica and her five friends. But Jessica only has five dollars. <laughs> Her job is to find out how many drinks she can get for her $5. It's my best friend's birthday is tonight, and we're all out to celebrate. Where is she? Right here. Birthday shots. Birthday shots. Look at this guy. Which one of you girls are paying for him? Yeah, you right right whatever. He's not paying for shots. Blah, 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 blah. I don't give a f what she said. Give all the pretty girls free drinks. There it is. <laughs> Start doing it. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shots. Happy birthday, Ashley! What a douche. This is what's unbelievable. We're seeing incredible amounts of alcohol being consumed, but have you seen one transaction? Have you seen no. one dollar move? I haven't no seen money. The That's why they're failing. No. 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 We're getting these shots. This guy's slurring his speech. He's consuming more alcohol than anyone in the whole building. Let me, let me help. 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 Get out of the bar. Get out of the bar. This is unbelievable. Oh, look at this. Somebody's gonna kill themselves. Shut, shut, shut. Everybody! They're all wasted. They're all wasted. Rob is at a point of unreasonable behavior. He's binge drinking, he's obnoxious, and he doesn't give a So if he doesn't give a I'm sending my experts in just to tell them I'm not coming. Hey, Rob. Rob, how you doing, buddy? My name's Nick Liberato. This is the Struggle Feria. We work with John Tapper. And we just watched you for the past hour and a half. Just want to let you know we're out of here, buddy. Have a good night. Dude, this guy can drink some beer. <laughs> He's grabbing for another one right there. Responsibility starts behind the bar. When you're this drunk, you cannot run a business. Do you know why Mickey was mad at Minnie? Because she was goofy. <laughs> what is he happy about, losing 2,000 a month? Is it like a sexual thing? Like you, all of a sudden you can start having an orgasm or something? What happens? Oh. You can see when Tom gets drunk, his mouth gets going, right? Mm -hmm. yep. He starts speaking vulgar, starts offending women. You told me you were a virgin last time I asked you. What? He's talking about Allie's virginity. Just embarrassing her. Oh my God, you are such white trash. Yeah, he called her white trash. You are so funny. Yeah. You don't know. know. Right, you don't Tom. know how funny you are. Hi, really. Don't get mad over it. She's working for him, and he degrades her in that way. Owners should not be drunk with loose lips in their own freaking bar. Tom, can somebody change the IPA? Crazy oh, girl, the oh, one tooth yeah. comes in, so just. Can somebody change the IPA? Like he said, Tom is too much enjoying himself. So why can't, he's not gonna tell him. Good head. You make complaints about the head. Say you never got complained about head before. Coco's a good girl. We love Coco. There goes a beer. You know your dad. How drunk is he right now? He's pretty drunk. George, I need a mop beer. He dropped the beer. Of course we're not making money, Laura. We got an owner who's so drunk he can't talk. I'm going to go to work, OK? I trust you. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right. I drink a lot of beer. I drink every single day, sometimes 12. <laughs> I wish that people would just like come in here and buy me a shot. Who didn't buy a shot? Didn't buy a shot. You know what I mean? I would love that. That would be awesome. That would be great. Oh. John Taffer. I'm Gaylord. How are you, sir? Your daughter called me and says to me, you're pretty much face drunk here every day. Who gives a This is your retirement we're playing with, right? It is. You worked for 27 years keeping us safe. You had the freaking courage to deal with murderers, drug dealers, right? I did. You saw the worst of the worst, but yet when you come here, you don't fight for anything. Why do you insult the people that work for you? I don't realize it all the time. I really don't. Coco, how often does he insult you? Just about every shift. Allie, what does he call you? White what? Trash. That's somebody's daughter! I'm the middle child. I got all the hand-me-downs and nothing new ever. <laughs> if you were three weeks from closing, Ashley, would you be smiling and drinking? Absolutely. Not. I didn't get a shot. You already found There's Christy. 
That's Rich's wife. So Christy is apparently very social. I understand she invites a lot of her friends to the bar. Another thing you don't do. He's completely drunk. It drives me nuts. I'm watching him drink. I'm watching her drink. I'm watching all the employees drink. And I'm sitting here like, you just don't care at all. I walk in. Whoa, are you guys break. No, this is our first time here. Her first time here. Really? We're visiting from Phoenix. Well, she's going to figure out a way to get a little closer. Uh, come here, Watson. Very cool. Did you, like, have a wild garden? Yeah, we're, we'll look it up later. We're trying to enjoy a night of just hanging out right now. You have two nice-looking women, well-dressed, uh -oh. laughing and having fun. Why wouldn't you make sure that they're taken care of? Of course. Of course. They're going to get more people in. They're going to get guys to stay and spend money. Uh, Chip's gonna get real pissed at me right now because I'm not serving him a shot. Oh, Chip doesn't need one, but he no, might he have one. Well, I am not trying to serve him. Try. I said I'm not serving you him anymore. Try. You don't want to party? Get the Yeah. Rich. Come on, come on, come on. Rich, he scared away my your girl. Yeah. Exactly. That's why. I, like I don't see him. Not, what is she? <laughs> I, I don't scared. see him. Rich? I don't see him. Stop! Like that! So this employee, Carissa, a good employee, working, gets harassed by a drunk customer. Rich does nothing to protect her. If that happened to you, you would never come back here, would you? No. He's justifying not supporting her. This guy's a jerk. Look at them, she's crying. You antagonize me, you're like, I don't see what, I don't see I what. I want to see why he's not defending her and why he's not stepping up, because he should. Carlos is I doing need the it. gross. I don't have time for this bull. You know what? Me either. We're transferring it to Caitlin. You know what? You do what you gotta do. How is it dealing with an owner who's that drunk? <laughs> I know. I don't know. How does he? Sucks. I know. He doesn't even give a. He Get says, out. "Deal with it. Deal with it." That's my ass on the line, and I'm not doing it. Yo. Yes, sir. Mr. Correct Manager, Mr. Engaged, Mr. Protect Your Staff, Mr. Be Responsible, Mr. Sober. How drunk are you right now? I'm not sober. Brandon! Brandon! What? Put some Janet Jackson on. I am not putting Janet Jackson on, okay? Uh, oh, excuse me. Brandon! You need to stop yelling at me at the bar. Brandon! Why is he here anyway? I hear he's barely ever at the bar, and when he does show up, he acts just like this. What the? Oh, come here. Oh, you're kind of, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, <laughs> Man. Brandon! What? You put Janet on or you're fired. You put her on your self. You own the jukebox. Why are you such a nasty bitch? Because you made me this way. Bitter and angry. <laughs> Livio, dude, what, what are you, what are you? Uh, I'm not sure what's going on over there, but. Uh, oh, it's gonna be a rough week. Let's face it, Paul is insulting his employees verbally. He's touching them physically. If you make your employees uncomfortable and degrade them, you'll never be successful. Is this normal? That's actually our, the owner. Good. Okay. <laughs> so we just came on the right night. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. You're getting paid for doing nothing. Stop yelling. All right. Oh, what the hell was that? If you would do your job, I wouldn't have to throw a glass at you. You well, suck. Suck. You know what? You know what? You know what? You guys should be fired. Fill my oh, drink. No, no. Chino, you're a manager, and don't make me ask again. Put some ice in there. These are worthless. This guy's losing fifteen thousand dollars a month. He's incredibly drunk, screaming, abusing his employees in front of customers. In any other bar, someone acting like that would be removed. Livio, dude, give me a lap dance. Come with me. How big you? I'm gonna lose it. It's time for me to go inside. This guy is the anti-owner. He's doing everything wrong that he possibly can, and the days of this club are numbered if I don't rescue it quick. I love to party, and I'm having a good time. When he comes in, he's all pissed off. Ooh, I'm scared, but you know what? Dude, he's here. <laughs>
Oh, John Taffer. I, I, I John. <coughs> How you doing? Good. Are you doing good? I, I so have heard of you. How drunk are you now? Because I've been watching you abuse your employees, disrespecting people. Yeah, because they suck. But they work for you, so if they suck, it's your fault, isn't it? Yes. So I'm... you're the one who sucks, not them. I know. Do you like being a failure? No, but... Are you losing $15,000 a month here? Yes. You think you're going to turn that around, cursing at your employees? I think they deserved it. They deserved it. Yeah. I say nobody deserves your abuse. Um, they deserve to be treated with dignity. How would you like it if I abuse you and tell you that you're a <laughs> Would you like it? I. Uh, Do you yeah. like when I talk to you that way? Why should they like it when you talk to them that way? If I do that, I'm a <laughs> aren't I? Right? Yes. So if you do it, aren't you a <laughs> too? There was no reason for to get like all that. Treat people like people. You don't talk to people like that. And, and my employees, they deserved it. Do my drink, oh bitch. Paul's actions are gonna cause him and his employees to fail, and I'm here to turn that around. I am. You're the manager, I am. right? Don't you treat your employees you with dignity or get them out of here, one or the other? Does it serve you well to keep an employee here and then abuse them? No. How's he gonna treat Dude, the other employees? Give me a drink, bitch. I'm talking. Dude, well, give me my drink. Paul, behave. Do my drink, no, no, please. I think he's a drunk. I want some more Jenna Jackson. I'd like to see you sober, because as a drunk, I have no interest in talking to you. I want a drink, bitch. This is getting worse by the minute, and you're only going to make your debt worse. I'm thirsty. I try to talk with Paul. He looks at me and says, I'm thirsty. The guy's been drinking all night. Get him the hell out of here. When he's sober, I'll come back here tomorrow and fix this bar for you guys. Get in the camp and go home, jerk. OK, give me a drink. I will see you all tomorrow.